All right, so we are going to have Green Beast versus Big Mac. I don't know what to expect here. Uh, I do know we're obviously going to have the Big Mac sheet. But I want to know if they're going to character-wise for Green Beast. Because he has Luigi, Olimar, and Sheet. So I'd like to see what he does. I don't know what he does in this situation. Alright, and it looks like I'll have uh, Demitus joining me. Everybody says they hate you, no one likes you, they want you <laughs> banned from the scene. I feel pretty bad doing that, especially after uh, him having face cut for you yesterday. That doesn't sound, uh, doesn't sound too fun at all. No. Uh, <clears throat> but, you know what, that's... So much for this really All right. Bad. But uh, let's go into this game right now. All my versus cheap. Um, Green Beast not going to ditto uh, Big Mac with Sheik. I'm pretty sure he just feels much more comfortable and going. I don't know what's going on. Uh, probably some sort of bun checker. Quite something. possibly. Maybe uh, maybe someone's tag was wrong. I didn't see tag or maybe input starts oh, being processed properly. But either way, I'm probably expecting to see uh, Sheik and Olimar. <laughs> Falcon punches? Oh. She can you do me a favor? Right. There should be, <coughs> I think it's pink, a water bottle somewhere <coughs> in that general All right, area. now we're starting up the set. So we got Ruby's famous Alamar versus Big Max. Oh, she why did he be there? I think that was probably not his uh, intentional input, but he doesn't get punished too hard. All right now, Green Beast with a slight disadvantage, but he can pick that, he can pick that back with a little bit of minion, uh, <laughs> Pikmin, not minions. See, Olimar is a very difficult character um, to, to play against. He just runs and throws Pikmin, and it's so difficult to, to deal with, especially because of his uh, his grab range is, is really weird. It's, it's like you can't see him grab, which is unusual, and that's why it's difficult to fight him. Yeah, sometimes I think like his grab is, is like grab is like a smash. <laughs> so like, you can't like his moves look all very similar. I remember once I saw Green. Somebody was on the top platform. I'm sorry, the, one of the bottom platforms on Battlefield, and it looks like Green is charging an up smash. So the guy jumps down in front of Green's forward smash because all his moves look so similar. Uh, another issue with, uh, I guess not an issue, but like something really interesting about Olimar is, is the fact that all of his attacks have different range compared, uh, depending on what Pikmin he has. So that's like a you have to game. keep yeah. a keen eye out for which Pikmin he has next. Yeah, you have to know Olimar as much as Olimar. And knows if he's himself. moving fast enough, you won't be able to tell which Olimar, which uh, Pikmin is next in line. Right here, I think this is where Green is going to struggle because he could get like charged by Sheik. Oh, he, he doesn't have a Pikmin. Uh, he could have followed up with a smash attack, but his Pikmin were too far away. Really close game, but uh, she can punch off the pigment for the hunting fish. Right, is this gonna be it? Right, no, yeah, he was not able to get to 50 50. That'll right, probably do it though. All right, so Big Mac will take first off. Uh, Big Mac at 102%. I think this matchup was like whoever gets the first stock will probably win just because Olimar now has to try a lot harder to seal off that stock and uh, he, he's gonna have to approach. All right, that wasn't a blue pigment. Blue pigment are the ones that kill. Uh, uh, I think. Throw. Does he need 20 more percent for that, or is that a kill percent? No. I think that's, uh, I think that's, that's it. Yeah, that's definitely I not think that's probably kill you. percent, just because Sheik is a rather light character. Oh, but he's not gonna need to grab because he got that down smash right out of his shield. Uh, Seven percent extra credit, nothing too, uh, nothing too good. That's pretty much just like a jab combo. All right, so Big Mac with this. Oh my gosh, this combo. Yeah, for, uh, 30. It was like 31 percent straight. Smash goal is generally a stage I do not want to take Sheik to. I know I don't know how Olimar benefits here or if he does, but. I, Even so, I never take Sheik. I think it's because the platform will give him a little bit more of a chance to recover against Sheik. Yeah, he definitely has a... Oh. And we have an SD. Very unfortunate game one from Big Mac. He was doing really well. Yeah, he had a... Uh, he was just comboing him forever. And and then Previous didn't have enough time or <laughs> much time to actually do anything because most of the match he's just getting comboed. Really unfortunate. So now we're going to see a game two. Um... Town and city? Almost screams these bands. 
Yeah, I'm gonna assume Green beat that Green beast uh, bandit, so we're going back to Smashville. Alright, going go back to Smashville. Ah, uh, that is not correct. Let me fix that. There we go. Alright. Uh Shell, what happened was that Big Mac SD. And that cost him the game. We should have an ST bracket. People who SD frequently in that bracket. I mean, he is the last game. He could, he could definitely still uh, do the reverse to him. It's definitely not uh, not impossible because he was he did have the lead. So, but I, but I think he's a little demoralized after that because uh, as being and losing a game like that that you were you were in a good place at definitely uh, makes you feel not too good about yourself. Yeah, uh, you're gonna be second guessing. So I think that's that's what happened. I think he's shaken up right now. It happens to uh, a lot of people. Some people can uh, just ignore it. Some people, unfortunately, have a little bit more difficult time. But uh. He's losing at the moment, but it's not too bad. Uh, mm, I guess it's not too bad. You could both these characters in life, but, uh, but Green does have a little bit more kill moves. And, uh, at the same time, with, with perfect placement of that Smashville platform, he can bring this nice one combo. Oh. Ooh. Alright. I was smart at Green Beast to move uh, slightly, like, slightly to right the whole time. Oh, I think he did the wrong throw, but uh, he's making it bad. I guess two blue pickings, so probably be looking for the grab. Yeah, there it is. There it is, that should do it. Yeah, that's that's gonna do it. Yep. Yeah, as soon as you see a blue pickman in that line, you better not get grabbed. If you're at go percent. And if you see if he has three blue pickmen, just run. Oh, oh, he gets the up smash. Wow, I actually didn't think that was going to reach. Uh, it looked like the platform was moving him away from that up smash, but maybe he extended his hurt box or something. It's quite possible. Had he, maybe he might have hit one of the pickmen first. Oh, it's can, can you do that? Yeah. I know she can bounce off the pigment, so I assume she I can think, up smash Yeah, that. pretty sure. Like if you threw out a forward smash or something. Right, right, right now, just, my lasers, my pop that, lasers just That brought back the game and put him in a much better position. Yeah, so he can easily, um... I think he's actually feeling a lot better now after getting that feedback. He says, okay, I can do this now. I can do it. Good. Good combo. Ooh, that was 26 damage. Now... Uh, it's yeah, about just even. like that, it's already, it's already tied up. Jeez. Oh, and he's having a lot of trouble getting back on the stage. Yeah, Grimmy's not letting him get that ledge. I'm not letting him get back from that ledge. 50%. And he's just gonna keep breaking up with these Pikmin. Pikmin? Ignoring Blue Pikmin? That's pretty smart. Blue Pikmin doesn't really do that much. Yeah, when you... Oh, he's gotta get that one off, though. That's All right, Okay, yeah, very wise to get it off right away. That one is a lot of damage. That's smart of him to recognize. Like, he didn't really do anything for the blue Pikmin, but as soon as he saw that white Pikmin on him, he didn't the thing with the other colored Pikmin is um, if they're on you and you're trying to get it off, you're only taking a little bit of damage, not too much, but you're also wasting time that you could be using, and you're also giving Olimar time to get his stage control. So unless it's the white one, um, in certain situations, sometimes it's better just to leave the Pikmin on you and keep attacking. Yeah, yeah, because if they're going to throw a Pikmin at your face and you're already running at them, might as well just keep going, unless it's the purple Pikmin. Um, for that yeah, one, you have, like, you have to show work. Good luck. It's the up and air. that's not gonna kill. Not gonna do it yet. I think another another one of those is actually gonna take the stock off. Nice tech by Green. Oh, oh that's no gonna way. be it. Very unfortunate for Big Mac to lose game one. Um, oh, you know what? Take those. You do. Oh, well, that happens. All right, so Green Beast 2-0 for Big Mac. All right, now we're gonna have GGA Dan versus Simple.